Hello everybody, how are you doing on this Friday? Um, okay, I know some people are sleeping and some people are still uh, uh, awake or not sleep. But as for me, my time is 4.30 in the evening and the day is Friday 24 November 2017 and the time for me to practice English by reading again and I always always try to speak before a reading because I want to practice my English skill and if you are enjoying with my video just click and any s y letter after I reading and after you listen on my clip okay and yeah, as you know, now I'm showing the story from our group or maybe article, but I think like it's some story and this story is interesting to me because uh, I don't know how to say in English, but we will see and just listen for me carefully. Okay, thank you. Let's start it. The case of the missing button. Matty Lindo, a husky tenth grade student scout as in the picture winters. You must be some kind of nut. I didn't slug Miss Casey and I didn't steal her purse. No? Unfortunately for you, a ninth grade girl happened to enter the corridor where Miss Casey lay. The girl saw a boy in the dark cardigan. Oh, sorry. The girl saw a boy in a dark cardigan sweater and brown pants living by the door at the far end. The inspector paused and then demanded, "Do you always wear your sweater bottom?" "Sure," replied Matty. "Why? Because you might have noticed the third bottle." from the top is missing, snapped the inspector. He held off the missing bottle. The girl who spotted your, uh, the girls who spotted you found the bottle clasped in Miss Casey's hand. I lost that bottle two days ago, retorted Matty. This girl, how could she be sure it was me in that long corridor? She isn't positive. She saw only your back. She saw only your back, but this missing bottle proof you did it. Luckily, Miss Casey isn't badly hurt. Now, where's her purse? Matty kept insisting he didn't know things about the slugging and death. The inspector told Dr. Halligan later, no doubt, says Heligan. The boy has some silly uh, alipi, alipi, alibar, alibars, alibars. Oh, sorry, I have problem about how to pronounce al alibar, alibar. Let me see. Was this how to pronounce this word? Uh, I think I just saw uh, alibi. Okay, come back and see alibi. Okay, where is it? Okay, let me start from she isn't, okay? She isn't positive. She saw only your back, but this missing button proves you did it. Luckily, Miss Casey isn't badly hurt. Now, where is her purse? Matty keeps insisting. Matty keep, kept insisting he didn't know a things about the slugging and theft. Death. The inspector told Dr. Uh, Halligan's letter, no doubt, says Halligan. The boy has some silly alibis, alibis about where alibi, yeah, alibis. Ah, sorry, <laughs> I'm reading. <laughs> no doubt, says Halligan. The boy has some silly alibi about where he was when Miss Casey was slugged and robbed. Right. He, cla he claims 
he got a nose to be in the school ballroom room at ten, at ten, fifteen minutes before Miss Casey was assaulted. He waited half an hour, but nobody shows up. Showed up. He waited half an hour, but nobody showed up. I trust you made an arrest. Asked Hurricane, "What was the guilty? Gil, sorry, guilty, guilty. Ah, uh, what? What was? What were the guilty students' order? Okay. Ah, uh, thank you for listening my oh uh, video, but uh, and I apologize. Some words I not sure how to pronounce, like a uh, alibi, alibi, alibi." Oh, all about, all about something, all about, oh, all about, and ah, oh, yeah, many words. If you if listen for me, I think I have many words because like assault, assaulted. Yeah, I think I pronounce correct. I'm not sure, but yeah, just listen for me and advise me how to do. I pronounce incorrect, and thank you for any people to who listen my video and bye I will see you in the next video bye